Walk over and hit that drum in exactly 9.58 seconds. <laughs> also, there are two bonus points for the person with the most magnificent walk. <laughs> the four who are not walking are going to be blindfolded in case they get hints on what is most magnificent. Does anyone have any questions? Um, what happens if we fall off the stage? Oh, you don't need to walk blindfolded. You should be all right. <laughs> Next to walk is Jessica Knappett. Good luck, Jess. What's the final prize task then, Alex? Well, I'll tell you about it if you just calm down a flipping second. <laughs> it's the thing that makes you look the toughest, like a nose ring or a nose stud or a nose bag. All right, Mike, regretting that yet? A little bit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> My toughest thing has a. Um, it's tried and tested. So if I'm, if I'm scared, and um, you know I've run out of milk and I need to. <laughs> Go out and get my nighttime milk. Yeah. <laughs> but I can see that there's some street toughs by the news agents, you know, <laughs> wearing leather caps and, you know. <laughs> some street toughs. Then um, <laughs> if that happens, then then I do this. <laughs> oh. oh wow. Wow. Oh. Wow. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Money. Oh, my word, £20. Buy the best present for the Taskmaster. Here is £20. You have ten weeks. Your time starts now. I think I'll look at Josh's gift next, please. Um, I've felt we've been getting on very well, Greg. Yeah, I think it's gone all right. I thought you'd worry that I'd forget you after this, so... I've got a tattoo. Well, you could have gift wrapped it. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> is it really? <laughs> is it? <laughs> <laughs> We're going to start with a prize task, and today's category is to bring in the most confusing thing. Uh, Phil, my confusing thing is a confusing little box. You want to see a picture yes, of it? please. OK, here's a picture. <laughs> it's a confusing little box that you can't open, but you can. <laughs> but you can't open it. But you can open it. Do you think you can open it? I can't open that picture. No, oh, you, you can, can open that it, box. But, yeah. Oh. You want to give it a go? It's a confusing little box. It's going to be good old telly, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> I'll just open the box, you pussy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I don't know where that came from. <laughs> I don't know where that came from. I don't know where that came from. I just got impatient. How was that all about? I'm sorry. I, I, I got over. I thought no, that no, was no, no, it's all right. in my head. I thought it was in my head. <laughs> it's all right. Oh, I've just taken charge of the box. If I've been there for 20 minutes or so, <laughs> I would have understand you getting irritated, but I still yep. wouldn't have expected you to use that sort of language. <laughs> but, sir, uh, you apologise and we'll leave it there. I'm very sorry. That's right. <laughs> huh? There you go. You want to try to open it? Here you go. when you're asked to complete tasks under pressure and there's a lot of people there. Buy a gift for the Taskmaster. You have 20 weeks. So, what's your name? Greg. <laughs> <laughs> no. Yes. 
there. I changed it. <laughs> I bought you a little square foot of land that entitles you to a lordship, and you are now Lord Greg Davies. Yes! For 20 quid. Yes, it's like this weird loophole because you guys are so weird and all like OBEs, they buy that anyway. It's actually uh, toxic wasteland. <laughs> you know, it's just a way of exploiting your ridiculous system. <laughs> it's a way of exploiting the ridiculous system, system in this your country. Lordship. Your majesty. <laughs> <laughs> Being photographed in the most unusual situation wearing this fez. You have eight weeks. What, Dre? Yeah, I think you'll agree this is an unusual situation. I haven't looked round yet, but if this is a fez superimposed on top of a picture of me looking fat... <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ, <laughs> you traitorous old woman. Who is, who is that, Greg? As you well know, it's my mother. <laughs> and she's here tonight! <laughs> she is. Oh. <laughs> Price task time, let's crack on. Yes, I suppose so, and I suppose the category for episode three is the item that sounds funniest when you say its name over and over again. Bridget. Stop, cock. Yes, she's brought... I think for the first time in TV quiz history, the winner will win a stopcock. Right. There it is. I want to hear stopcock repeated. Stopcock, 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 stop, stopcock, stop. Babe, stop, 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 don't go on your knees. No, 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 no. <laughs> stop, stopcock. <laughs> This potato into the golf hole. You may not touch the red, green. Fastest wins, your time starts now. Oh, we're off. <laughs> uh, what, what about if I can't, if I don't get it? There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Fourteen point three seconds. I didn't think that was me. I didn't do it either, Nick. Well done, Joe. <laughs> really emotional. <laughs> I think that's the best thing I've ever done. I don't know how you feel, Catherine, but it made me like sport. <laughs> <laughs> it's incredible. How, I mean, talk us through it, how were you feeling? Instincts. That it's incredible. It's so incredible. I personally, I'd love to see it again. You want to see <laughs> it again? Yeah. 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 Okay, here it is again. Oh. oh. <laughs> That's joyous. <laughs> Please don't take it away from me. <laughs> please, oh. please. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, I've got a real sense of power then for a second. <laughs> I'll tell you what I'm going to do, and it's unprecedented, and don't think that we're going to do this for the rest of the series, because we're not. It's a one-off. I'm going to allow your fellow competitors to decide. Hey. Good luck, mate. <laughs> <laughs> we should send Joe out of the room and take a vote. Yeah, you should go. Off yeah. <laughs> 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 I mean, I thought... I don't know. <laughs> Four of you there, you've got one vote, so I guess uh, raise your hand if you'd like uh, Joe to win, despite the... Yay! Yeah. Oh, it's... <laughs> 
So you don't think Joe should get it? No. I think if you really <laughs> analyse the slow-mo, <laughs> those couple of centimetres that he gains over the red, were you to take them away and it be a clean shot, that potato would have been all rim and bounced out. <laughs> I mean, even that was lyrical, wasn't it? <laughs> that potato would have been all, all rim, rim and bounced out. <laughs> I'm telling you, that, that, those centimetres were a crucial advantage. Do you want to bring him back in and uh, deliver your verdict? Yeah, yeah. Go he on. can come back have in, but he can't step on the red. <laughs> <laughs> Joe, yep. I gave your fellow contestants the opportunity to save you, and they were unable to conclusively do that. <laughs> Therefore, on this occasion, I'm going to have to say that your uh, attempt was uh, null and void. I apologise. Oh. 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 Right? That is harsh. That's harsh. <laughs> <laughs> Throw your items into your bucket. You must select one item when Alex blows his whistle. You must then throw that item when Alex blows his whistle again. If your bucket falls, you are disqualified. Most items in a standing bucket wins. Oh! oh. <laughs> 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 wow. No! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> All the buckets are still standing. Yeah. Which it's is me much... versus you, Kyle. No, it's Frankie. you versus everyone still. It's nothing. <laughs> <laughs> Please select your penultimate item. Oh. <laughs> Let's play. OK, good luck, everyone. Oh! Wow. I've never seen gameplay like that as long as in 15 series. Uh, I resign! Yeah. <laughs> Completely erase this eraser. Your time starts now. You tell me when it's completely erased. I don't know if this will help. Are you, Paul, uh, under the impression that you erased that eraser? I removed it from society. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably still an eraser, isn't it? It's been erased. I, I'm not sure that is a ray. I really. I mean, I... you could see yours in a mush by your feet. Yeah, but it could no longer function as an eraser. It was no longer an eraser. Mine's just in a, underwater in a pipe. But it's still an eraser. It's, it's not. It's, it's not. It's lost not. It's function. At this point, no one's ever going to use that as an eraser again. They, if they really, really wanted to, they could find it and and it would still be intact as an eraser. And also, I think that erasing is the act of using it to. Where rub. the f is this come from? <laughs> of putting in, like, loads and loads of just genuinely, like, physical effort into the task. <laughs> and then these other people found some swanky workaround. <laughs> they, like, put some f effort in. <laughs> I don't know where that's come from, I'm really sorry. I've been really nice to... <laughs> So, the prize category for this specific show is Best Thing from the 90s. So, I love the 90s, cos they were the end of me being a toddler. My toddler years were the worst years of my life. <laughs> People used to grab me by the arms and swing me around. <laughs> so, I brought in a collage of goodbye to my toddler years. OK. F*** off! <laughs> is there any part of you that wants me to hold you upside down now to make sure that you didn't have a good time back then? You couldn't hold me upside down. Yes, I could. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hold him upside down. Yeah. <laughs> hold him upside down. <laughs> That's a joke. How are you even doing this? Yes! I loved it. <laughs> One at a time. Make a noise without the taskmaster identifying you. The person who makes the most unidentified noises wins. What's going to happen is the taskmaster will not be looking at you. 
I will give you a type of noise you have to make. You have to make the noise for at least two seconds. Greg will guess who he thinks was making the noise. The category is big, scary, monster. The penultimate person is this person. They're at the front, and here comes the noise. I don't, know. I don't know who the wow monster is. Standing in a queue, draw the most accurate pictures. Alex will show the person at the back of the queue a picture. The person at the back of the queue must draw this picture on the back of the person in front of them. The person at the front of the queue must draw the picture they think has been drawn on the back of their pad. You have one minute per drawing. No one may communicate with anyone else. So can I just check? Have I been put on a team with David Baddiel? <laughs> okay, you have one minute. Starting. Let's draw. What, what are you doing? No communication, please. No communication. I can't communicate. <laughs> he was gripping Ed's finger and stopping him from doing anything. Right, David, that's, that's it. That's all you get. Six you seconds left. Oh. Six seconds. What are you doing? Why are you still drawing? <laughs> Stop the drawing, What's stop the drawing. Wait. Have you done? No communication, please okay, wait, well, please wait, please stay, was... stay at the front, stay at the front. You were literally just drawing anything. <laughs> Let's draw. Katie's using very big flamboyant movements at the back. Look at the stance on Gamble. Great, yeah. <laughs> Two seconds left. <laughs> Well, this time we've asked them to bring in, for the prize, the most cash. So what I've done is I've brought in a blank cheque mm -hmm. and I'm just going to put 1p more than whoever is in the lead. <laughs> <laughs> just just yep. win. There's a cheque. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, but are you good for it, Lolly? What have oh, you got? Oh, yeah. What cash have you got? Well, I'm sitting on £2,000. What do you mean? In cash. What? <laughs> I just thought, just have a backup. I have two so grand. I, I ventured out. Very strong. <clears throat> Read the taskmaster's mind. The taskmaster will choose a card. You must state if that card features a horse or a laminator. You will receive one point for every correct answer in a row. Comes Joe Brown. So currently in last place. If you get 15 in a row, you will you will tie. Piece of piss, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, oh right, is it a horse then? One point. She's on her way. 14 to go. 14 to go. Laminator. Two points. She has overtaken the person above her now. Um, is it a horse? How many have I got? You've got four, 11 to go to tie. <laughs> Laminator. Oh, God. <laughs> Laminator. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Right. Horse. <laughs> Laminator. I mean, I am starting to think she is reading my mind. <laughs> no, no, no. Um, horse. <laughs> oh, it's got to end sometime. Horse. <laughs> oh. uh, laminator. <laughs> Three to go. <laughs> come on, let's come on, let's everyone, come on. Put your hands around. Come on. Close as mine. Laminated. Oh. <laughs> so this is for 14. Laminator. Oh, it's over. Oh. 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 Oh.